Hello everyone, welcome to this video by Simply Learn. Do you know in 2024 companies really need people who know how to work with cloud technology? An AWS solution architect, for example, can earn more than $150,000 every year. Well, that's a pretty big paycheck for someone who's good with AWS. Regardless of experience level, we will guide you on becoming an AWS cloud engineer. In today's video, we will be covering important step, basic ideas, Linux operating system, fundamentals, and AWS services. Along the way, we will also learn why is it important to get certified in AWS Cloud, discuss hands-on projects, and get ready for a job. This roadmap will not only broaden your knowledge, but also unlock numerous job opportunities in the field. Craving a career upgrade? Subscribe, like, and comment below. Dive into the link in the description to fast-track your ambitions. Whether you're making a switch or aiming higher, Simply Learn has your back. Also, just a quick info, guys. If you are interested in becoming a cloud architect, look no further. Simply Learn's Cloud Architect Certification course is your pathway to master AWS. This course is aligned with the latest exam announced by AWS, and you will learn how to design and scale AWS cloud implementation with the best practices recommended by Amazon. Explore the basic ideas and tools with these important cloud platforms. This will help you make strong, reliable applications. Our complete training will quickly make you skilled in cloud computing. Don't miss out the chance to change your career in cloud architecture with Simply Learn. So without further ado, let's start the first topic. Our first topic is understanding IT fundamentals. The first step includes understanding and building a strong base of IT concepts like how networks work, TCP, IP, OSI model different operating systems like Windows and Linux, and how we manage data. This starting point will make it easier for you to understand cloud computing. Moving on to the second step, which is learning cloud basics. This includes learning about cloud computing's main features, its different services models they provide, like infrastructure as a service, platform as a service, and software as a service, deployment models like public, private, and hybrid, which will help you understand how cloud computing changes the way business work. Get to know the main cloud platforms like AWS, Azure, and Google Cloud. Understand what basic services they provide such as computing, storage, and networking. These basics are very important for you to start your journey to become a cloud engineer. Now we will move on to the third step, which is gaining programming skills. Well, to become a cloud engineer, we do not need any coding background, but having considerable programming skills will certainly help a lot. Learning any of these programming languages like Python or Java will let us automate our task and work with AWS, improving our abilities as a cloud engineer. We have now covered the basic fundamentals and learned essential programming skills. We will now be looking ahead to the fourth step, which is diving into AWS services. The first step includes learning about AWS services and the tools that every cloud enthusiast needs to know. First of all, let's talk about compute services like EC2 and Lambda that allow us to run our applications and code effortlessly. Installing Linux operating system, creating directories and installing packages is a must. AWS provides reliable storage options such as S3, AWS and EFS where we can securely store our data. It also uses other services for networking such as VPC and security groups to connect and secure our resources seamlessly. Also for managing our cloud environment with the use of tools like CloudWatch and CloudTrail help us monitor, track and automate services effortlessly. Finally, using containerization technology such as Docker and tools for managing containers like Kubernetes is very important. After learning all these services, we have almost achieved 90% of our journey. 
we will not talk about the cloud security. Cloud security is very important. Using identity and access management, encryption and access control makes sure that our data stays safe. After ensuring cloud security, we have understood AWS services. We will now move on to the next step, which is using DevOps with AWS. So in this step, we will learn about using DevOps principle to automate setting up infrastructure and deploying applications by using tools like Terraform and CloudFormation. These tools help us to make our configuration much more easier. Well, after learning all these topics, you are all set to go. But wait, do you know having considerable knowledge without certification is not sufficient for you to become a cloud engineer? Let us see how. AWS cloud certifications are very important and the question is why should you get one? Well, certifications prove that you have knowledge about AWS. Having knowledge without certification is like flying a plane without pilot's license. Missing such certifications might hold you back from getting your dream job, especially if you have no work experience. Getting certified will help you validate your skills and make you stand out to employers. In short, we can say that AWS certifications are very important as they validate our skills, open doors to new opportunities and also show dedication to growth. We now know the importance of certification. So in the next step, we will talk about some real world projects in cloud computing. One way to gain practical experience is by working on personal or open source projects. We can create and set up a virtual machine, use different tools like Terraform and deploy them in our web app. Also, we can create cloud storage solutions. These projects will allow us to apply whatever we have learned in the real world. Another approach is to implement solutions in a cloud environment to solve real world problems. By working on the actual challenges faced by businesses or organizations, we will get hands-on experience and learn how to effectively deploy cloud technologies to address these issues. Till now, we have covered all the essential steps. We have almost completed our journey. Well, we are all set to apply for jobs. But before that, remember, networking with professionals via LinkedIn, freelance gigs, building portfolios, and collaborating on projects to learn and grow together are very important to land your dream job. Finally, we can start a job search, prepare for interviews, and confidently secure our dream job as a cloud engineer. And this was all for the AWS Cloud Engineer Roadmap. I hope you guys found it informative and helpful. Simply Learn provides a wide range of courses, projects, and support resources to ensure your journey as AWS Cloud Engineer is both fulfilling and successful. If you liked this session, then please like, share, and subscribe. If you have any questions, then drop them in the comment section below. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for more videos by Simply Learn. Staying ahead in your career requires continuous learning and upskilling. Whether you're a student aiming to learn today's top skills or a working professional looking to advance your career, we've got you covered. Explore our impressive catalog of certification programs in cutting edge domains, including data science, cloud computing, cybersecurity, AI, machine learning, or digital marketing. Designed in collaboration with leading universities and top corporations and delivered by industry experts, choose any of our programs and set yourself on the path to career success. Click the link in the description to know more. Hi there, if you like this video, subscribe to the Simply Learn YouTube channel and click here to watch similar videos. To nerd up and get certified, click here.